Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tank here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to run a command on startup automatically on your Windows 10 or Windows 11 computer using the task scheduler utility. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So all you have to do is open up the search menu, type in task scheduler. Best match, should come back with task scheduler. Go ahead and open that up. On the right side, you want to select where it says Create Task. Go ahead and left click on that. And now you can name this task whatever you want. It doesn't really matter. But when you go underneath Configure 4, click on the drop down and you want to set it to Windows 10. Select the Triggers tab. And then you want to select where it says New. In the Begin the Task section up at the top, click the drop down. And you want to set it to Add Startup. And make sure Enabled is checked marked at the bottom here. And then select OK. In the Actions tab, click the New button. And now I'm going to have an example in the description of my video here, guys. So I'm just going to have my Windows on the C drive. And then in the parentheses bracket here, you would delete whatever this is. And you would type in whatever command you wanted to run at startup. So again, you just would completely get rid of this bracket here and just replace it with the command that you wanted to run at startup. So you can just delete that box and then type in whatever command you want to run at startup. And then select OK. And then you would select Yes. And then you would select OK again. And I have not named it yet, so you can just type in whatever you want here. Just It would probably be better if it's something that you can easily identify. So I'm just going to do Command Example. And then I'm going to select OK. And then you would need to restart your computer in order for the change to take effect. And then once you restart your computer, it'll always run that command at startup based on the parameters we gave it. If you ever wanted to remove or modify that task, we could come back into Task Scheduler here and go underneath the Task Scheduler Library. And you can go and expand underneath wherever your example was. So I just named it Command Example. You can double click on this and then you can modify it. And one other thing I do want to point out, you, underneath the general tab, if you still have the task in here, you probably want to check mark where it says run with highest privileges. Depending on the type of command you're going to run, I just want to point that out. I kind of went a little quickly through that last one there. If you're running a certain command, you may need to have administrator permission. So you want to check mark where it says run with the highest privileges on the general tab. Just want to point that out there. You want to make sure that is check marked. Again, depending on the type of command you're looking to run. So once again, I do hope this tutorial was able to help you guys out. And I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.